With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello guys, welcome to Dot and today's question we have to find the length and the foot of perpendicular drawn from point 2 comma minus 1 comma 5 on the line x minus 11 by 10 is equal to y plus 2 by minus 4 is equal to z plus 8 by minus 11. So we have given point comma minus 1 comma 5 and we have given line equation which is equal to x minus 11 by 10 is equal to y plus 2 divided by minus 4 is equal to z plus 8 divided by minus 11 so the condition is given is like that that we have a line and now from point p we have to find foot of the perpendicular point and we have to find pq also so first of all let put our equation x minus 11 by 10 is equal to y plus 2 by minus 4 is equal to z plus 8 by minus 11 is equal to r to find q coordinate because q if q is coordinate of pq line that means it should also pass the line l because it is lying on the line l so that's why we are putting here r so from here we get x value as 10 r plus 11 y value as minus 4 r minus 2 and z value as minus 11 r minus 8 now we have p coordinate and this is our q coordinates and we have p coordinates given now we will find direction ratio of pq and we know that when we have given two coordinates of points how to find direction ratio formula is x2 minus x1 comma y2 minus y1 comma z2 minus z1 so when we use this formula our direction ratio of pq will become 10r plus 9 minus 4r minus 1 comma minus 11 r minus 13 now we have direction ratio of line l given as 10 comma minus 4 comma minus 11 now we have a relationship when lines are perpendicular to each other then their direction ratio relationship is a1 into a2 plus b1 into b2 plus c1 into c2 is equal to 0 so we will use this formula so it will become 10 r plus 9 into 10 plus minus 4 into minus 4 r minus 1 plus minus 11 into minus 11 r minus 13 so now from here we get 100 r plus 90 plus 16 r plus 4 plus 121r plus 143 is equal to 0 so from here we get 237r is equal to minus 237 so from here we get r value as minus 1 now we get r value as minus 1 we will put our r value into this to find q coordinate and q is sort of perpendicular so when we put into our q coordinates our q coordinates will become 1 comma 2 comma 3. Now we have to find distance between PQ and P coordinate is given as 2 comma minus 1 comma 5 and we know that how to find distance between two point using distance formula which says D is equal to x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square plus z2 minus z1 whole square this is our distance formula so we will use this so our PQ will become PQ is equal to under root of 1 minus 2 whole square plus 2 plus 1 whole square plus 3 minus 5 whole square so from here we get pq is equal to 1 square plus 3 square plus minus 2 square so from here we get pq is equal to under root of 1 plus 9 plus 4 so we get pq is equal to under root of 14 so our distance between point p and foot of perpendicular is root 14 and q coordinate is 1 comma 2 comma 3 thank you guys i hope you like my video for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today